Hi guys, welcome to another Get Out Fitness, Get Out Online Strength Complex Workout. As usual, we have two exercises. First one being a kind of strength based exercise and the second one being a mobility exercise. The mobility exercise is mobility, but it's also going to work some strength as well. You do need some core control in the second one. Um, just to let you know, it is a stiff leg windmill. So if you're not too sure what it is, don't worry, I will show you the exercises. The first exercise is going to be a single leg um, knee tuck. Both exercises should be achievable. Maybe a little bit of practice on the second one, but that's what we're here for, guys. I'll show you the exercises, you go away and work on them, and hopefully we all get fitter in the process. So let me show you the exercises now. So as always guys, I'm going to show you the two exercises, um, give you a demonstration, a couple of reps on each, then we'll do a full circuit and then go away, do three to five sets, and you can add that into your normal workout routine. So exercise one, I'm going to lay down completely on the back, flat on the floor. What you're going to do, put your arms behind the head, try and lift, the feet, the legs, the shoulders and the arms off the floor and bring one knee up and bring both hands over that knee. Come back down to stretch everything out, try and keep everything off the floor and then bring in the opposite knee and that'll be two reps and three and so on guys. So you're working the core muscles but you're creating more of a workload on one side than the other just so you can try and balance out any um, imbalances but don't worry if there are some imbalances like I've said plenty of times before it is a common thing in the human body one side is stronger than the other we're dominant on one side generally left-handed or right-handed before I get into too much of a waffle our second exercise stiff leg windmill so you're going to place one arm above the head and what you're going to do is if you put your left arm out, you're going to push your hips to the left hand side and all you're going to do from there is reach the hand down the body, get down as close to the floor as you can and come back up again. You want to try and keep your hands above each other at the bottom of the exercise, come back up and also you want to move to the side, not forwards. Happy with that? We're going to do five each side on that one and for the first exercise we're going to do 12 reps. Let's do 12 reps so it'll be six on each leg. Ready? So we're going to do it as a complete set. Lie down on the floor, 12 reps, six each leg, arms out, feet up and lift. One. Two. If you need to rest the feet on the floor, you can. Three. Four. Five. You start to realise that this is also a balance as well. Six. Seven. Eight. Bring that foot all the way in. Nine. Extend it out. 10, 2 to go, arms behind the head, bring it up, 11, opposite side, finish off, back down for 12. Come on up, get your feet just a bit wider than shoulder width apart, one hand above the head if it's the left arm up, put the hips to the left hand side and we reach down, try and reach the floor if you can without bending the knees, one, keep those legs straight, two, three, you'll feel the rotation in the shoulder, that's perfectly fine, four, come back up, so we're stretching and then we're strengthening for five, opposite side, one arm up, push that hip to the other side and let's go down, one. I like to look at the hand. You can look forward if you want, if you've got a mirror, just to check your form. 
three, four, and last one, down and up for five. Nice one guys, it's a very quick exercise, if you want to go for more reps you can, maybe do ten each side rather than ten all together. With that first exercise, try and keep the hands, the shoulders, the legs and feet off the floor for the entire um, set, really helps engage those abs and more importantly, the lower back muscles. So try that out guys, do three to five sets, minimum rest in between. As always, stay safe, stay fit, and I'll see you again next time. Take care.